Hello, my name is Stephanie Kangway, and I'm here with you today to do an introduction on the new Matrix Multi Cushion. This is kind of a hybrid product. It actually, uh, as we take a close look at this, we're combining some of our great characteristics from a few other cushions we've had in the line uh, to offer you something that really has terrific uh, immersion, great pressure distribution, and a lot of comfort. So we actually are starting with the base foam that you would be familiar with from our VI cushion. Um, so this is a high resiliency foam. And you can see that we have um, a very nice ab and adduction contouring. And in the rear, this is, has our extended rear radius design uh, and slight elevation on the lateral aspect. So we start building in our positioning right away with the base foam. Uh, and then this piece is actually placed into a mold to do an, a second injection molding of a different type of foam. Um, and what we and are, are going to have as a result is our base foam still and the top shaping that you're looking at. There is also a white, this is a visco elastic foam, but it is in the, sh the top shape orientation of our PS and PSP cushion. And so um, we have a little bit more distinct in, uh, uh, enhancement of the ab and adduction contouring with this, but in a very, very soft memory foam. And you can, as I turn this around, what you'll, you might be able to start seeing with this is that how this, this combination of stability with the base foam from the VI and this top layer where we start to get our immersion characteristics with the viscoelastic memory foam uh, in the PS shaping. And as I pull this out, you might slightly be able to see those indentations with that slow rebounding viscoelastic foam from the, um, from the top or the mid cof, uh, cof, um, molded layer. And then on the top surface of this, uh, we are adding our breezy foam. Now this is how this is going to result from this three foam combination. Uh, so we have a top layer of a, about an inch of breezy foam. Uh, this particular foam, very, very soft foam. It really enhances your initial contact immersion. Um, so it's a, it's a real, like just an initial, a real great weight distribution uh, layer. And, Quickly, we are immersing into this breezy foam and then getting the ischial tuberosities into that mid layer of that viscoelastic uh, that is in the shape of the PS topper. So with this, the other thing that's really unique with the breezy foam that you're, that you're seeing here, um, this has a gel component to it. So we have a slight heat dissipation uh, uh, benefit from the breezy foam. You can see that we wrap it over the front. We're still maintaining our slightly waterfall or bevel front uh, cut design, still maintaining, as I had pointed out with the base, our nice um, rounded rear radius, extended rear radius in the little rounded corners here. And we end up with a lot of immersion and stability. I know this looks like a very thick product, but the, the, these two top layers that really maximize immersion end up with a lot of stability benefit and you still are getting that transfer as we always like to do with lateral loading, getting more weight bearing on the greater trochanters through the femurs and ending up with a much more protective target for our higher at risk ischial tuberosities um, in, the, in the pelvic structure. So when, when we have our foam, um, the, just the pelvis model, just sitting into it, we end up with a lot of immersion just as I do that. And so we have that little quick rebound um, layer that you're looking at here. So I have a, another version of this. It's kind of cut apart into a couple different pieces to give you a, a little bit of an uh, inside look, if you will, at the structure um, of how the, how the um, multi will uh, actually really maximize these, these uh, positioning benefits. And so not only do we have this nice lower um, rear ischial target, when you open this up, you can kind of see the thickness that we have here of our breezy foam top and our visco center. Um, and 
how we have those slight ramp ups on the lateral aspects for that greater trochanteric support. And then you start to see as I open from the front, as we, as we remove that front edge, you can really see with that ab and adduction contouring how we end up with the immersion for uh, the fingers. So, and there you really kind of see the amount of immersion that we can get with this product. So there's a lot of stability with this construction, um, kind of a, as I might describe as almost like a little butt hug. Um, so we end up with a tremendous amount of stability and really enhanced comfort with this design. So the, uh, the Multi is going to feature a uh, two cover. Um, of course, we love doing two covers uh, on the Matrix product. So uh, inner cover here is our reversed StarTex inner cover. So this is a fitted zipper cover. Um, the, uh, the wipeable surface, great moisture barrier to protect the foam, uh, easy to wipe down with disinfectants. So if this is exposed to any bodily fluids, very easy to keep this clean. And the outer cover on the Multi uh, is more like, uh, more like what you've seen with our PS and PSP, uh, where we're using StarTex again as the outer cover, but this is also sewn as a reversible cover. So right out of the box, fabric side out, labeled front left corner, and you can turn this inside out and have a nice finished, still labeled front left corner, seams and Velcro still on the bottom, extra moisture barrier to double that up if you need to for your consumer.